All right, let's take a look at the data for the city of Chesapeake, Virginia. The month is November 2023, comparing it to November of 2022, and the trend line is all in between here. $361,500 is our median sales price for the city of Chesapeake for the month of November. Comparing it to November of 2022, had a slight increase of 4.3% from $346,500. Typically, what we've seen is a 3% over, over history, many, many, many years. And so we're still slightly above that. If you look at our other videos for Norfolk and Virginia Beach, this number is 9, 9%, uh, still a 9% increase. But here in Chesapeake, it's really starting to normalize and fit in with the rest of the graph that we're going to be looking at, at 4.3 and uh, 361,500. So close transactions, settled sales, 211. That number is down from 288, 26.7% decrease in uh, that data. So this is telling us the market has definitely slowed down uh, in Chesapeake. Median days on market, 21. This is starting to become a normal number, right? We look back at last uh, November, 18 days. You can see here in the spring, 10 days, 11 days, right? Uh, but 21 is definitely more of a normal market number where things take a little while to get under contract. Uh, average percent of list price, you're going to get 100%. And you should get 100% if your realtor did their job and helped you establish value for the home. That's what you should be getting, just as a buyer's agent would be doing the same thing for a, a buyer. Uh, median sold dollar per square foot, a little bit higher, 6.7 than the uh, median sales price. It's $200 is our median sold dollar per square foot. New listings on the market, 268. That number is down from 313, 14.4% uh, decrease. And uh, while well, you can see we really skyrocketed there in June of 450 properties on the market. And now we're at 268 uh, new listings. 515 is our active inventory, though, and that number's down uh, from the 575 of where it was last year uh, for the month of November, 10.4% decrease in active inventory. And, of course, our month supply of inventory is definitely telling us that we're starting to normalize the market. How long will it take to liquidate our current inventory if everything else remained the same? 2.4 months of inventory. Here you can see back it was two months of inventory. It got as low as 1.1 months of inventory in June. And here we are back at 2.4 months of inventory. So what does it mean? Well, if it's a buyer, you've got to be regressive still. You're going to need to write a solid offer uh, and have a strong negotiator on your side. We are here at Redefy. We're definitely here to help you do that as a buyer. For a seller... Uh, we offer a pretty amazing program. It's a flat fee. It is $5,500 plus a $300 setup fee, no matter what the price is, right? So it's not based upon how much can we sell your house for. It's based upon here's how much money we can save you, right? A $700,000 home uh, at a 3% commission, let's say, is $21,000 in real estate commission. We are here to help you. It's $5,500 plus a $300 setup fee. No surprises, professional photographer, uh, realtor comes out, does the market analysis. We hold your hand from beginning to sold. Check us out, redefyflatfee.com. Please be sure to check out the other videos, Virginia Beach and Chesapeake. We're going to be back next month looking at the month of December. Merry Christmas, Happy New Year. Make it a great day. Stay safe out there.